I grew up knowing about Jesus, but not who he was. You could call me non-denominational if that was even valid. I would say the same prayers every night, but there was no meaning behind them. Was I even practicing my faith? In seventh grade, I started going to St. Brendan's. At first, I didn't like it, and it was so confusing. Why can't I just be a non-denominational Christian, I asked myself. I was invited to my friend's Baptist church, and to be honest, I wanted to convert and start going there. However, I eventually started to cling to Catholicism, and by going through youth groups like Conquest and Lighthouse, I started to grow in my faith. I started to desire going to Mass and Adoration. Retreats were where I really started to see growth. A weekend away from the distractions in life made such an impact, and I would say the retreats were some of the best moments of my life. Despite all this, my faith has always been up and down. It's never constantly stable like I want it to be. I'm either really into my faith, or I'm not. Sometimes I think of it as a roller coaster. Some hills are taller than others. Sometimes I go up higher in my faith than other times. Currently. I would say I'm at the lowest in my faith that I've ever been, if I'm just being honest. It's funny because I went from my highest in my faith to where I am now. But I do think I'm starting to go back up, but it's been a long and hard and tedious process. I feel like sometimes I'll never get back into the faith, but I'm always wrong. In a way, faith is somewhat supposed to be like this. That's how we grow, it's like working out. You have to weaken your muscles and wear them down to get stronger. I wish I could say faith is smooth sailing, but it's not. If you feel distant from God, just know that God doesn't distance himself. My best friend always tells me, God doesn't orchestrate the bad, he makes good come out of it. So when something bad happens, or you're in a low in your faith, don't think God is mad at you or punishing you, because he's not. He will make something amazing come out of it. You just have to trust in his timing and do your very best. Faith is a journey, but it is the best journey you could ever embark on. My name is A.J. Atanasio, and this is why I'm Catholic.